What's up and welcome to Fat Bear Week 2022 day five. Um, it is the very first semi-final which means we only have two bears to look at today and they are 747 versus 435 Holly. Saddle up and show up for the sundown showdown. Brooks River ain't big enough for the two of them. In reality it is, but in the competition it ain't. On one side of the river, the incredible bulk 747 funnels fillets like a frequent flyer. Further downstream, the Queen of Corpulence, 435 Holly, is looking for a quick draw comeback for her superfluous solidity. This ain't their first rodeo. Because we're at the semifinals now, that means we've already seen these bears, we've already gone through their lore, we've already taken a look at the pictures, and so while we are gonna spend like a tiny bit of time looking at the pictures, it's at this point in the competition that I really like looking at uh, the trail cam footage and the videos that Cat May Park has provided. Um, they've actually selected specific clips and I want to share those with you because I think that we can only look at the pictures for so long, I think that we need to get a little bit of a better idea of what the bears really look like out in the wild. So, um, looking at these two, I think that um, just looking from a progress perspective, that's the perspective that I want to look at when comparing them. I think that they started out in a somewhat similar place, maybe 435 Holly looks, she looks a little smaller. Um, it's a little hard to tell with 747 just because he looks very disheveled in this picture. You know, so you kind of get this sympathy for him and you think, oh well he started off worse off, but no, we have to look at just the fat. And uh, I think that you know, 435 Holly started off a little bit smaller. And so progress wise, I think that even though he had a little bit of a head start, I think that he ended up um, fatter than 435 Holly by a pretty big amount. Um, although we should not in any way downplay 435 Holly's um, Im like improvement just because look at, look, she did not have a hump here and now she does, it's massive. Here, look at this, she's so, She's so thin here. And then look at this bulging ball of fat. But at a first glance, I would say that 747 does look a bit heavier. So now I want to take a look at the footage. So here we can clearly see um, 747 on the left, on the right is 856. We can see that he is so massive, he's so round and his belly hangs so low that he's clearly struggling to get up this hill just because of the sheer amount of fat around him. Um, you know, he's, look at, look at this effort that he's making, just trying to get up there. Okay, uh, he, he's made it, but it was definitely a struggle. That was no easy feat. So we could see, you know, how much water he was displacing. We could see the struggles that he was going through. And so now we're gonna look at 435 Holly. The clip, by the way, is called Holly 435 Holly looking fat, <laughs> which is really accurate. She just looks massive here. Um, we can clearly see her rolls, um, but she seems to be fine. Her belly, as we can see, isn't hanging that far down um, compared to 747s. And here we can see she has a lot more agility compared to him. He was really struggling. Um, and so, personally, I think that 747 is the bigger bear in this case. He truly is a tank, um, or a jumbo jet more accurately. And so I'm gonna vote for 747. They're very, they're pretty close. It's not a landslide win, but uh, he's definitely in the lead. And so, 435 Holly, I want to say congratulations for making it to the semifinals. 747 was truly a um, difficult opponent, but I think that she's done great. Have a happy hibernation, uh, Holly, and I'll see you tomorrow with uh, the second semifinal. Peace.